Hi, I'm Natalie Arroyo. I'm Andre Codner. And this is Panther News. We have so much exciting news for you guys today, so let's just get started. On the 12th, there was a Group 4 showcase held in the Arts and Science Building from uh, 3 o'clock to 5 o'clock. Uh, here are some interviews and pictures. Hey Panther News, today I'm here with Mishko Soto. Mishko, what science are you in? I'm taking biology with Mrs. Gaucher. How did you like collaborating with the other sciences to get this project done? I thought it was pretty cool to see how everything is kind of connected in a way throughout the sciences and also to work with my other peers who I don't get to see. We only have 10 students in biology so we don't always get that many um, different perspectives and so it was cool to collaborate on a project that we could all put our own input into. And now I'm here with Mario Diaz. Mario, what science are you in? What was your favorite part about collaborating in this group for project? My favorite part about collaborating is the connections I make. Definitely. Throughout my physics experience this year course, I didn't really know much of the bio side because I've been so centered around physics. And with this group four, you get to explore a different realm of science and gain a perspective for what you don't know. Definitely. What advice would you give to the juniors doing this project next year? Definitely don't procrastinate. Get it done as soon as possible so you have time for errors and just enjoy it and have a good time. And now I'm here with Eddie Lopez. Eddie, what science are you in? I mean, physics and level. What struggles did you go through that you overcame throughout this process? Well, my group wanted to focus on circuits, but the problem was that we didn't know anything about circuits because um, we didn't cover that subject in class. But what we managed to do is we actually uh, like se separated ourselves from the class and actually did the research on our own. And we invested into topic five, which actually gave us a boost in the class, and we're learning about it starting this week, which. Um, it was like a boost and, yeah. <laughs> if you can do this over again, what improvements would you make? I would say... I would focus on the materials because the materials were was a really big problem for us. Um, so like the cables that we use, they, they were increasing resistance, which decreased the, the flow of energy. And say if we use copper wire, that would that would help us for like the lemons. Great, right, thank you. I just want to congratulate all the seniors for doing an amazing showcase, and hopefully when it's our time to do it, uh, we can actually live up to your standard. December 22nd to January 2nd and it's going to be our winter break and it's a great idea for you guys to be working on your Khan Academy during these two weeks since at the end of the month Mrs. Theo will be checking in with the MIP students to see their progress on Khan Academy. So um, I hope you guys have a great break and enjoy those two weeks that you guys have. On the 17th there's a guitar recital that is going to be held in the cellular lobby and it will start at 7. So come and support all your uh, friends that are in guitar. There will also be clips in the next Panther News episode. Thank you guys for watching this episode of Panther News, and we hope you guys have a great weekend. Bye, Bye guys. guys.